The Festival of Trees is back at the Museum of Aviation. 41 NBC's Cameron Branscombe went down there to see what the excitement is all about. For the second year, the Aviation Museum is holding the Festival of Trees, bringing some joy and hope to the holidays. The Museum of Aviation's Festival of Trees began last year to help cheer up the community after it was reeling from the pandemic. President and CEO of the Aviation Foundation, Darlene McClendon, says some people have taken tree designs and turned them into mini commercials. Some people are very creative and they market their business with some of their actual products or the products that they use so that you definitely get the opportunity to market your business. The Festival of Trees had 12 trees last year, but has grown to almost 30 this year. McClendon says people have been entering trees up until the last minute. Once we launched the opportunity to secure a tree and the applications for the trees, we quickly filled up. And then we got people saying, please let us come on, you know, and, and we've even had someone in the last two days call up and say, do you by chance have another tree? That someone was Donna Hunt. Hunt is the Hope Gardens coordinator for the base. Hope stands for help available, opportunities exist, people care, and expect good things. Hunt says the program was started to help troops through difficult times. Robbins Air Force Base has a very high suicide rate. And we wanted to do something to combat it. So the HOPE program was born through the Resilience program to help people that are having crisis. Hunt, a master gardener, is using gardening to help aid people in times of crisis. We decided that a garden would really be a good symbol for HOPE. So we have the HOPE gardens where we have a lot of uh, different activities. And then the HOPE program is just a base-wide and it's a wonderful program. The event is open to the public. You can purchase a $5 People's Choice ticket to vote on your favorite tree. Reporting in Warner Robins, Cameron Branscombe, 41 NBC News. Well, the Festival of Trees is holding a community night. Tickets for the event are $20.